House Majority Leader Steve Scalise announcing that he has been diagnosed with a form of blood cancer. Senior Congressional Correspondent Rachel Scott is on Capitol Hill with the latest. Good morning, Rachel. Gio, good morning. Leaders on both sides of the aisle are wishing Congressman Steve Scalise well this morning after the Louisiana Republican revealed he has been diagnosed with myeloma, a form of blood cancer. Scalise says that he wasn't feeling himself. He decided to go to the doctor. In a statement, he says he's very grateful this was detected early and that the cancer is treatable. Scalise is the second highest ranking Republican in the House. He says he does plan to return back here to Washington and work through his treatment, which is expected to last several months. Myeloma is a relatively uncommon form of cancer. According to the American Cancer Society, roughly 36,000 people will be diagnosed with it this year. And of course, Scalise has overcome immense medical and health challenges in the past. You may remember back in 2017, he was shot and critically injured while practicing for the congressional softball game. He made a remarkable recovery, returning back to the field one year later. In a statement, House Speaker Kevin McCarthy says not a gunshot or cancer can stop Scalise from anything he puts his mind to. Guys. As you said, he's already overcome so much, Rachel, and we pray for his full recovery. Thank you so much. Hi, everyone. George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.